My name is Emi Kudo. Um, I'm a celebrity manicurist working in Hollywood. You might have seen my work on magazine covers, billboards, film, and red carpet, celebrity red carpet. Um, I'm working for such event. Morning routine. Mm. I start my day to a cup of espresso like everyone else. We need a coffee. And I put a little bit of honey and almond milk in it. That gives my um, brain energy. Then I try to do um, 10 minutes yoga every morning just to set the intention and stretch my body. I think those habits are really important. Like set your intention, just don't rush yourself out and then uh, be neutral. I've been working as a manicurist um, for 23 years. I've got a nail license in 1997. And I started work on the set 15, 16 years ago. So yes, as a freelance, yeah, that's about it. It was 1996 or five. Um, I was working as a specialist in a beauty salon in my hometown in Japan. And then um, the owner of the salon, she was a visionary. Um, she was doing a lot of new things. Um, for example, aromatherapy, facial, or creating your organic skincare products, um, something like that back then already. And so this owner, um, all of a sudden, one day she said, hey, Amy, I can see that nails industry is gonna grow big. I'm see, um, I can see nails, nails gonna be a trend. Um, so I get you, why don't you take some nail class and then provide a service for our clients. So she got me a class um, next week, I think, um, just half day, about six hours. I took a nail art lesson and the next day I already start acting like a professional nail artist. She was a little bit of, um, hustler, like a conning, but she was right. Since then, nails became really big. So I tried to bring a calm and a neutral and a peaceful energy to the set. I believe this world is made by energy, like everything consisted by energy. So I try to feel um, other people's energy and then um, try to deliver the something peaceful and neutral. And I think that's very important. Um, I was super lucky to be introduced to two big celebrities, uh, clients of mine um, at the beginning of my career who names Angelina Jolie and Janet Jackson. Um, so eventually they started taking me to their video shoot or magazine shoot or like any other project. So I would meet um, other people on the set. For example, um, Angie took me to my first American Vogue cover shoot. Then I met um, a Vogue legendary fashion editor, Tony Goodman. So Tony would um, take me to another magazine cover shoot. And then, you know, another one and another one. People to people, I meet another creative directors, photographers. So they would book me for another project. So on and on, it's just cycle. It's, it's just, you know, by the mouth. Okay, so what's great to work with the celebrity is um, you get the ability to get a best top products in the industry, beauty industry. Because product company is always looking for the opportunity to work with the celebrities. So um, you can receive the really nice product without worry about cost of the kit. I'm a single mom and as a single mom, I could be able to provide my son much better life than I was working at the salon, so which is great. I 
as a nail tech, um, I think Billie Eilish um, Grammy nails, uh, Gucci nails are the so far the coolest nails I've ever made. But there's a lot of other memorable projects that I have done. Um, for example, a lot of iconic Vogue cover shoot with the fashion editor Tony Goodman. And then a movie Maleficent to um, Nails for Angelina Jolie, Maleficent Nails. Also, like a lot of Janet Jackson's cool music video um, with that beautiful her, herself and her beautiful dancers. Um, those are the projects, my favorite projects I have done. And my son has received a lot of love and like attention or care, sometimes like a wonderful gift um, from my clients. And then that could be very um, supportive and helpful for us. Um, Angelina Jolie, one time she supported his education as well. And then that was the most beautiful things happened in my life. And talking about the stressful situation, well, the stressful situation is everywhere at the work. Well, sometimes it could be, uh, you know, people being difficult or it could be very challenging situation, it could be tough schedule, or it could be sometimes extremely hot or cold weather. But um, you always have a choice. If you do it, keep doing it, or leave, leave there. Um, I kept um, doing it. I decided to stay there. That's why I'm here today where I am. And I made a special nails for Ghostbusters too. And then um, I collaborated with the um, award, uh, Academy Awarded Special Effect Makeup Artist, um, Arhen. Uh, Arhen Tritin, he's a very famous um, special effect um, makeup artist. Um, yes, you will see in the movie, but I made something like a not human beings, um, some like a really cool clothes. So I'm originally from Japan, Fukuoka, Japan. That's the uh, south part of Japan. I'm a southern girl, yo. Just joke. <laughs> yes, I'm south of Japan, which is not a Kyoto, which is not a Tokyo. But uh, it's a nice city. It's a little bit like uh, LA. We have a lot of mountains, oceans, and then, um, yes, many entertainment people come from the city. Um, honestly, I have never thought about the difficulty that much. Every day was exciting, um, you know, a lot of stimulations. And, um, but uh, if I pick one, um, at the beginning of my life, I financially struggled. Um, I brought, I came to this country with only two big suitcases. Packed the dream and some dollars in the bank. But later, soon later, I realized that I have to live very modestly and I couldn't compare with when I lived in Japan with my family. Um, I was completely starving on artists. So that was a struggle. Describing myself, um, people often say about me, I'm happy, sweet, kind, funny, Oh, I know they lie. <laughs> so I want to share my experience and um, send the hope to the world and the people who's struggling right now. Yes, I have a um, strong team. Like I have a um, trustable assistant. And then also my agent, I've been working together with her for 10 years. And my fiance, Joel, um, since ever we met, he believes in me. Yes, so I would say I have a very strong supportive team. I had to support my little son and I have to leave him many hours. Um, so that was hard. Sometimes um, I left him for a couple of nights and 
he was a little, um, yeah, and I had to fly to the other city um, for the shoot. My the first shoot um, was Vogue magazine cover. Yes, I had to leave him. So yeah, that was a struggle. I mean, my happiest day when I see, when I go to the grocery store and I see, ooh, not only one, but two, three magazine covers um, at the cashier. And then my clients that I work with together for, they look so beautiful on the magazine covers. Um, that's my, uh, yes, man girl is the secret happy moment. Angelina Jolie, Miss Angie. Well, um, that's why it's, I know it's a big question for everyone. Um, I would say after all these years, try to detach the ego, um, control your ego. So I'm discovering that all the worries come from your ego. So doing a meditation, like, you know, quick yoga in the morning, that helps me so much and I go through the uh, in, in, intensive days. Um, yeah, so just empty yourself, be ready for the day, and then control your ego. What's cool about my work, there's many things, um, but if I pick one, um, meeting uh, cool people, like uh, top, top of the industry. For example, like uh, um, my walk one day, um, Annie Leibovich is shooting American Vogue cover and Angelina Jolie um, at the Brad Pitt's private house. She was a beautiful Oscar de la Lonte house. And then the other day, Peter Lindbergh would um, shoot Natalie Portman with his house, um, you know, the wonderful gram team, um, very ins inspirational. Julian Dees, uh, Stefan Murray. Like, uh, you can see all these people in the same room, and um, it's pretty cool. And then you are part of it. Oh my gosh. Uh, the first of all, you have to be good at your craft. For example, if I do the nails, um, I was very detailed, um, so that got people's um, attention, I did the detail work. And you have to have a craft, but at the same time, um, you have to have a great customer skill as well. You have to be a good, uh, w uh, a great team worker. You have to be trusted by people. Because a lot of the um, things that happen by people's mouth. Um, so, yes, that. And also, um, you have to invest your time. Um, for example, making a portfolio, you know, if you don't have uh, anyone to ask you the uh, job on a set, um, do the credit only work and then um, correct your portfolio. Try to meet the people and uh, be good and then uh, be, uh, have a great manner. So people would remember and people would book you so you're going to meet another people and another. Um, in this world, people bring the job. Um, it's a job, jobs are brings by the people. So you have to be trusted. That's the advice that I can give the people.